Hey guys, welcome back to the KTLC fan base. It's me, Joey, and today we will be going over some new flashback art. Um, we have some new art, and it's for flashback, not for legacy, but it does tie into legacy, just like the Sofits art did. This art is of So Keith this time, and they're in Havenfield. Sophie is looking all nice, so is Keith. We haven't had a good picture of Keith in a long time. The last time it was, it was kind of like last year, but we just got Fitz, and then we got Fitz again. So it was good to see Keith again in official art. So we also have some other big news. Legacy is officially done, and Shannon Messenger has reposted this picture on Instagram. This picture. And it's been, it's like printing, and everything's getting ready for November 5th. So, the scene of Sophie and Keith, they're in flashback, and they're holding hands, and Sophie's kind of looking at Keith, um, like, worried or something, and Keith is kind of just, like, looking down at their hands. Um, we don't, I'm not really sure what this kind of symbolizes for legacy. The scene is actually, um, I'm not sure, like, the exact page number or chapter, but it's in flashback, and Keith is saying, like, nobody loves me this, uh, to Sophie, and then Sophie reassures him, saying that, like, everyone loves him, and she... Or not loves him, and then she cares about him too. And it's a really sweet scene, and I'm wondering how this ties in the legacy, because it could tie in like two ways. Either Sophie and Keith are holding hands and they're like getting together, or that's how like she's telling him, I don't like you, I'm with Fitz, or something like that. Because they both seem kind of like worried or not scared, just like kind of they're not feeling good, they're feeling down. So last week we got a So Fitz art, and this week we got a So Keith art. So things are kind of now balanced in the nature, in the natural of so keith and so fits battle so it could really go either way in flashback or i mean legacy we don't know it could be so keith it could be so fits it really it could even be none of them which would be kind of confusing or not confusing it would be really unexpected because like she could be a counselor or something and that would kill every single one of our theories except for that one of course that could happen because you know shannon messenger is famous for her flat or for her for her uh cliffhangers and when she was finished writing legacy when i saw that um post i was like wondering what cliffhanger did she write for flashback or i keep saying flashback i mean legacy now it's kind of gotten weird because we have so much stuff about ships like all the art the iggy colors everything that leading up to legacy has been about ships and even on the cover the cover is just literally a triangle of sophie fitz and keith so literally everything leading up to legacy has been about ships so naturally legacy has to be a big shipping um, both just like flashback was but flashback did have some action and i am hoping for some action to counter to counteract the all of the shipping stuff and we really think that this book is going to be the deciding book so keep or so fits or nothing and also there's like an even odd theory of the books because book one was odd and it was kind of a so fits book book two is even and it was a so keep book so on so on legacy is even so it should supposedly according to the theory be a so Keith book but then that would mean that book nine would be so fits so it's kind of weird it's just a theory but it does actually work but we think that definitely legacy will be the uh, book to decide so Keith or so fits i think like the plot of the book has gotten way off from like an actual like girl fighting the never seen to ships 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 like flashback was like the biggest shipping book ever and there was so many pages that were shipping and so many pages that were not actual plots and battles and training and stuff. I'm not saying there was a lot, or I'm not saying there was, like, no battles and training. There was a lot. But I think I want to see a lot more of them training and battles. I keep saying training and battles in Legacy. So thanks for sticking along to this little short video. I just wanted to get out all this information. And I think that's going to be about it for, like, the Legacy news updates and new art. Because Legacy is only two months away. And we really, really, we really can't wait for Legacy to come out. So that's definitely going to wrap it up for this short video. Make sure to like and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye, guys. Bye.